Okay, so hi guys, this is Miss Lollipop, Pop and welcome to my video. So in today's video, I'm very, very, very excited because I have prepared over 200 CC links for you all. Okay, I was dedicated to the time and effort here. <laughs> so we're gonna be going through my favorite CC links for Mouths for 2022. This is only going to be um, hair and makeup and clothes um, and you know eyebrows um, and beards and things like that because I'm gonna be doing a separate skin details video for men as well. I've already done one of these videos for women. I've done my favorite women's skin details, uh, clothes, hairs, things like that. So if you guys wanna go ahead and check that out i will leave them in the top right hand eyes right now so you can go check them out this is the cc links file um it's a google docs file it's going to be linked in the description if you guys want to go ahead and download all of these links really really simple you can literally just click and then click on the link and it will link you straight to it and they're all numbered um so let's go ahead and jump into the showcase uh, i'm going to show you everything in game but yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed this video it took me a really really long time to get all the links and to make this video so if you guys do enjoy this video remember to go ahead and leave a like make sure you go ahead and subscribe if you are new so that you get updated whenever i upload i do a bunch of sims 4 series i also stream over on twitch four times a week as well if you want to come watch me play some sims Sims. Um, and yeah, I do a bunch of these CC videos as well. So if you want to keep up to date with my CC, you can go ahead and check that out. Okay, so first up, we have all of our Mao hairs. Now, um, you might notice a lot of these hairs, they're from very uh, similar creases. In fact, the whole entire CC list in general, a lot of the creases you will see come up quite a lot. So for hairs, um, for Mao hairs, I use a lot of Sonia Sims, Anto Sims, um, I'm trying to think, uh, Wings uh, and Mood as well. They're my favorite CC creators. Um, recently, I'm going to be honest with you guys, I have been leaning more towards uh, Maxis Match CC for uh, locks, for, uh, for twists and things like that, because I feel like Maxis Match CC uh, can sometimes look better in game than Alpha. But for my straight hairs, I will always, always revert back to Alpha. I just cannot get behind Max to Smash for straight hairs. So yeah, you can see a lot of uh, you can see a lot of the straight and like wavy hairs. I've got you know like a lot of a lot of links for these. Um, in fact, you guys are just looking at the mood hairs right now, which are my absolute favorites. Um, this creator is my absolute favorite for male hairs, and as you can see, I have a massive collection of all their hairs. So although I'm only showcasing a few of my favorite of their hairs, I actually use every single one of their hairs in my game. So if you guys want to go ahead and just like check out moods. Uh, Patreon or their, you know, Tumblr, just download absolutely everything because honestly, they are so good. They are so worth it. And probably one of my favorite hairs out of all of them to use. Definitely would highly recommend. Um, I use a lot of wings as well. I really, really like wings because it has, you know, it has a lot of detail. The hairs look super realistic, but the color swatches, they do really let the hairs down, I think personally. Um, they don't come in specific color swatches, like they don't come in a brown, like in some hairs, they don't come in a, in a proper blonde, they don't come in a ginger, so it's just really difficult using Wings hairs sometimes, but they are some of my favorites purely because of the style and the quality of them, so yeah, I would definitely recommend downloading all of the ones that I've linked, but if you guys want to go ahead and check out any of these creators and just go through their um, what if I, if I link you to like a Patreon, um, to that creator's Patreon, you could, you're more than welcome to just click on the Patreon and just scroll through all their Patreon stuff and just download anything that you like. So if you guys like, you know, uh, the content that I'm showing from a specific creator, there's probably a lot more hairs that look exactly like it or not exactly the same, but the same sort of style. So yeah, definitely go and, you know, look through these hairs or whatever I'm linking and look through that creator because they're normally pretty good. Um, I also have a few of my alpha uh, dreads in here um, or locks uh, and also uh, twists as well because I use a few alpha CC creators, but honestly, I use a lot more Maxis Match for, um, for my locks and things recently. I just feel like, um, I feel like they're a little bit better. I don't know. I've as, Although I'm definitely an alpha simmer, um, I would say that recently I have been a, a Maxis mix. I can't remember what I called it the other day. What did I call it? Mixes match or something like that? <laughs> I don't remember what I called it, but it was something. I just made it up pretty much. Okay, next up, we're moving on to our Mao beards. So I have a lot of really good alpha beards. I'm not going to lie. I went on a downloading spree probably a few months ago and I got a bunch of these hairs. A lot of them are by Intro um, or they're by this other creator, obviously Obscurus. I have a lot of things from Obscurus as well. Um, from Praline Sims, they have a really, really good like beard collection, which I link to. So you guys can just go ahead and download the whole beard collection because all of them are really great. Um, but I also found this new creator who we're going to be coming up to in a second. 
we just went past them and i can't remember what their name was um oh it was intro it was intro you see this it's like a really big bushy beard i feel like we never have any of these for alpha cc so i was really happy i found that <laughs> for my old men you know <laughs> All right, moving on to our eyebrows. Again, I use a lot of really realistic eyebrows. So I've got a few uh, more Maxis Match eyebrows in here. Michael polls me. They're like realistic Maxis Match, I feel like. But honestly, most of my eyebrows are all alpha as well. I feel like I feel like a lot of them, even Maxis Match, even Maxis Match creators, they also use alpha eyebrows as well because I feel like they look really good on, on Sims. Like they're really good quality. I don't know why. I've seen a lot of Maxis Match creators use them as well, but... Honestly, they look bomb. They look great. Um, and I like a lot of like thick, bushy eyebrows on my men as well, because uh, specifically my boyfriend has those and I, they're kind of a statement, you know? <laughs> um, so we are moving on to hats. I love a good accessory on my men. I love to accessorize them. I really, really like a grungy type of style. Um, you'll see from a lot of the clothes that I'm linking and the shoes and things. I love a really grungy type of style on my men. Um, so yeah, I, I've given you like a, a very... I've, so I've so although I have a lot of CC that's like exactly the same like I have a lot of like caps or I have a lot of like specific types of hats that are exactly the same I tried to give you a bit of everything so you see here I gave you like a cowboy hat but then I also gave you a few beanies I gave you a bucket hat I gave you like you know a bit of everything backwards cap you know for our um for our uh, well I don't know racer boys they're not really racer boys that doesn't even make sense <laughs> a beret see for our stylish artistic boys you know um, and another slouchy beanie. Don't we just love that? <laughs> uh, but yeah, I tried to give you a little bit of everything. So hopefully you can see that. Moving on to our makeup. The first few links are eyelid overlays. These are for mono lids. Um, so for, for certain skins, sometimes if I'm making like an Asian oriented sim, um, the skin that I'm using doesn't have the mono lids. This is so you can just add a mono lid overlay and it's perfect. Uh, we're also moving on to some of my blushes. Love this blush. Cutest little freckles ever. Love, love, love. This is my favorite highlight of all time. Use it on every single sim. I'm not even gonna lie. And lips. I use a lot of lip overlays on men. These aren't specifically um, like actual lipsticks. They're basically like lips that make your sims lips look really realistic. Um, so a lot of my Mal Sims uh, CC, like the skin details, it doesn't have like great lips. So I normally add like a little lip overlay and then I just turn down the opacity and I feel like that adds a really, really nice like realistic effect onto the lips as you can see. So I'm just showing you with the opacity turned down as well. Okay, moving on to our accessories and I'm telling you guys there are a lot of accessories so you better brace yourselves. <laughs> Um, so first up, I'm pretty sure we're going to go through the earrings first and then we're going to move on to the um, to the glasses and then to the necklaces and then we'll move on to the full body um, accessories as well. So here are a few of my favorite earrings. I really love that like grungy, I don't know, like rocker style for my men. I, I really like going for that in Sims. I don't know why. I think it's because a lot of my, my creators for CC, they make a lot of CC for that type of style anyway. So I feel like it's easier to lean more towards that as well. Um, so a lot of these piercings you'll see are definitely kind of like that. These glasses are so cute. I love these. So this is like a duo set. So here's one set of glasses and here's the second. Um, so they're they're a set. They've both got the same link, but you can download whatever one you want. Uh, these glasses are really perfect. Also, these glasses, they don't just come in like a normal glasses version. They also come in a sunglasses version. So you, they double as a normal glasses and a sunglasses, which is great because it means you only have to download one piece of CC and it doubles as both, you know, so you're not like using as much space. Uh, next up, we're moving on to our necklaces. I use a lot of necklaces on men as well, but there aren't that many necklaces. So um, I say I use a lot. I use a lot of what is available because I feel like there's not that many. Um, but yeah, I definitely like, I definitely like to accessorize my men, you know, I feel like, I feel like that's good. This is my favorite scarf. I love giving my Sims this scarf as well. And this one too. This one always conflicts with eyelashes though. So you do have to move your eyelashes into a separate place. This is so cool. Look at this lip piercing. Like, look how cool that is. I love that. And in all the colors as well. Oh, obsessed. <laughs> and we're moving on to uh, some watches. So I've gone ahead and zoomed in um, and also some, you know, these are full body accessories, basically things that they're easier to show you if I zoomed in. So I just went ahead and zoomed in for you. Uh, we've got a few rings here as well. Love those specific rings and also some Adidas socks as well. As I said, I tried to give you a bit of everything. <laughs> 
All right, moving on to our tops. Now, this is what I meant by you will see the same creator over and over. Specifically for my clothes for men, I literally use about two creators. One is called Gorilla X3 and the other one is called Dart77. Now, I feel like I pretty much linked every single piece of CC from them because these are my main male CC creators. I have actually found that there's not that many... Sorry about that. My dogs were barking in the background. I just wanted to tell them to be quiet. I have two new puppies, so it's a little bit of a stress. <laughs> uh, but yeah, anyway, so I feel like uh, I only really use two creators for Mouse CC. It's normally Dart77 and Gorilla X3. Reason being, there's actually not that many good alpha creators for men. Like, there's really not that many out there. So although in this collection you'll see random pieces from other creators, my main pieces of CC are actually from these two creators because they really are the best. And I don't like settling for like bad quality alpha CC. I feel like to get alpha CC right, it has to be really, really good quality. Back in the day, there used to be these like these alpha pieces of CC. I, I, you guys will remember when I tell you. They literally looked like they were drawn on, like with a paintbrush. Like there was no like 3D-ness to them. They were literally like, if you turn the sim around, they were like flat to the sim's body. And I feel like there are still some pieces of Maxis Match and some content that the, the actual Sims team come out with that looked like that. And I just cannot stand that. I think that looks such such bad quality in game. So I feel like with Alpha CC, I really, really love like the high quality type of stuff, um, which is why there's only really a few creators in the links because I feel like there's actually only a few creators who make really good quality Mal CC. Because I'm not gonna lie, I've been through some other creators and although they're good, it's just like some of them are a bit naff, you know, like they're just not that great quality. Um, and there's not that much of a variation. So I tried to give you a bit of a variation with these tops, like different styles, you know, um, here we've got like a string top for jimmying. We've got a few with like jackets and things. I, I like to stick my men in quite a lot of jackets as well. Um, some like layered tops as well, like just trying different variants. This is one of my favorite coats. I love this. I love a good long coat on a man. Like, can you blame me? <laughs> um, yeah, I've just tried to give you a bunch of different, you know, outfit ideas, uh, including teens as well. Here's a few, um, here's a few like open beach tops, quite like those for beachy moments as well. Oh, really quick. Uh, you might've seen one of the, a few of the tops that have come over and they've got like a notification that they're only available for, uh, oh, sorry, that they're not available anymore because they're Patreon exclusive. When I made this video, obviously I didn't know that they're Patreon exclusives. I only realized when I was going to collect the links. So I just want to apologize for that. If, you know, any of the pieces of CC that you guys want aren't available, you're more than welcome to go and check out the creator because I've normally still tried to link them or link the creator. Um, you're more than welcome to go and check out the creator who made them and ask if, you know, if you could get that piece of CC from them. Um, but you probably would need to be a Patreon. I imagine that if you're not a patron of them, you won't be able to get them. But at least you'll have the name to be able to say, you know, you released a piece of CC in this month. Um, is there any chance I could download it? So hopefully that will be helpful. But yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know that I am sorry if you can't download. Uh, I think there was about three different pieces of CC. But out of 200, only three pieces of CC that are like not available anymore, like not an actual link. I don't think that's half bad, to be honest. <laughs> I don't think it was that bad. Um, so we moved on to the jeans quite a while ago, as you can see, you can probably tell my sim style, I use a lot of like really grungy outfits, but I did try to like include a bunch of different outfits as well, so I've got like shorts in here, um, chinos, some like more formal bottoms, some swim trunks, pajama bottoms, uh, jogging bottoms, uh, yeah, I've literally literally done like a whole a whole collection of CC for you guys. So hopefully, um, even if you don't like all of the CC, there'll still be like a few pieces that you would like to use in here. I want to make it so that, you know, if you guys don't exactly like my style of CC or the style of CC that I download, there will be something at least in this whole category that you might like to use in your Sims. And I feel like if you're like me and you're using Alpha CC, we just know that out, out here, the C for Mal CC is really quite dead. Like... It's like, there's nothing out here. It's quite dry. So we just take what we can get at this point, you know? <laughs> we really do. All right, next up, we are moving to the full body outfits. There's not that many for men, honestly. Not a lot of creators really make them. But to be honest, I would rather use a top and a bottom for men anyway. So it's not that big of a deal. Um, This pajama set, I love. This is like a full body pajama set. It reminds me of The Sims 2 days. I don't know why, but it just gives me a good old throwback to that. Basketball uniform, love that as well jumpsuits i love this for my stylish men for their party wear outfits i don't know why i just have a thing for it my overalls for my farming men <laughs> i feel like i have a specific piece for everything 
And one of my favorite sets of suits is just coming up right now, the three-piece suit. I love this. Um, and I don't actually have anything else from this crater, so I might need to go searching for that. <laughs> All right, next up is the last category, which is shoes. Shoes are one of my favorites for my men's. I tried to include a bunch of different shoes. So we've got a few different boot options, a few different trainer options, um, some like loafers, um, some boat shoes as well. I tried to include a bunch of different things. Uh, so yeah, hopefully, as I said, you guys will find something that you like. Uh, but I'm probably gonna go ahead and wrap up instead of rambling so you guys can go and enjoy the CC links. Go and download. Uh, don't come at me if your computers break, okay? I am not gonna be held liable if uh, your computers break from this. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I hope you enjoyed the format as well. Go ahead and let me know if you've got any suggestions of anything I can improve. Um, anything you think could be improved for another video because I will be doing a few more of these. I love you guys so, so, so much and I will speak to you in my next video. Remember to go ahead and like the video and subscribe and I will see you all later. Have a great day. Bye guys.